We've long speculated about the rise of Asia, but Asia has already risen. So what will it mean for Asia to lead globally? Asia is an engine of global economic growth. Soon, its GDP will eclipse the rest of the world's GDP combined. Asian countries are now the largest providers of foreign aid and investment. Prosperity has lifted hundreds of millions out of poverty and given rise to entrepreneurs driving global high tech. What does this mean for global markets, supply chains and geopolitical competition? How will it shape global opinions, norms and institutions? Of course, there is no single Asia. It's home to 60% of the world's population, some of the most globally connected and isolated countries. India, the most populous democracy, and China, the most influential autocracy. Like the rest of the world, Asian countries are grappling with democratic erosion, rising populism, and climate-driven crises. What does this mean for political stability, regionally, globally? With China in the driver's seat, how will Asia lead? What does the shift towards Asia mean for the next century? Join us as we use historical and political perspectives to explore these issues from the headlines and beyond.